Okay guys, just a quick one. Um, this might be useful to some of you guys. Uh, after flashing the wrong ROM, uh, trying, to, um, trying to get this phone, uh, the FRP removed, this is what I come up to and I can't get the phone to go on um, download mode or any other mode. It's just stuck in there. Every time I click on um, uh, home button, volume down and power, it comes back to this mode. So uh, this is a quick fix to get you guys away from this mode and to get you guys um, running, uh, going back into download mode so you can flash other firmwares. So all you need to do is hold the home button and you'll come up to a download mode now here this is what you want to to be seeing um, that and that and then if you press uh, I've got a phone in my hand so I'm gonna try and um, I'm gonna try and do this with just one hand so if you press down down power and home now you should go into the warning screen. There we go, see? So now you're on the warning screen, you just have to press up. And as you can see, my FRP is already off, but it's custom now. So the binary is Samsung official, but the system status is custom. That's the reason why I got into that mode. So that's just a quick fix so you guys can get out of a pickle. This is, uh, this obviously is, is going to be a common problem and uh, uh, it's, it's good to have, um, it's good to have some, a good fix for this because, you know, uh, without this fix, you won't be able to flash any other firmware. The phone is not recognized in download mode. Odin won't work, Z3X won't work, nothing will work, recognize the phone uh, as uh, ready to, to install another firmware. So thank you very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.